guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Victoria. So happy that you guys are here with me today. And for my first time viewers who are joining me for the very first time, welcome, welcome, welcome. Today I'm making one of my favorite weekend meal. Chicken fried rice. You know weekend? Oh, what do you guys say to order Chinese food and Japanese food? Well, I'm making mine at home. That way I can go back for second and third <laughs> servants. And this is a very quick and easy dinner to make. It's super, super easy. So I'm going to show you all my delicious ingredients to make this super easy, healthy dinner. But guys, I know that sometimes you guys are in a rush and you don't get to watch my video until the end. But please watch my video till the end. That's the only way my video, YouTube will recommend my video and I'm trying to grow my channel to be super successful. And I thank you guys for tuning in all the time. So let me show you my delicious ingredients. So guys, here are all my ingredients to make my chicken fried rice. This is my chicken. This is two pieces of chicken breast. They're organic chicken. And I already just cut them up in small pieces and these are all have chicken seasoning on them already. And I have here garlic and scallion and these are spicy seasonings and onions. And this is just a, a bowl which is two cups together uh, of carrot and green beans and corn, sweet corn. And my sesame oil, you cannot make um, fried rice without sesame oil, so this is my sesame oil. And my organic so soy sauce, and this is, uh, I picked this up at my neighbor's supermarket. It's ginger taiyaki sauce, it's delicious, I love using it in my fried rice. And my organic butter. And of course, my rice. So this rice is actually, it's was in my freezer because whenever I'm going to make fried rice I always cook my rice first and then I put it in the freezer and let it freeze for maybe 20 minutes or even more if I forget <laughs> and what you'll do the reason I put it there after putting everything together and stirring back and forth sometimes your rice become like extra soft and picky but when it's going to fridge it keeps them much harder to stand everything and it just makes them come out perfect so first thing what I'm going to do now, I'm going to sort of fry up my chicken for a couple minutes. Chicken doesn't take long to fry. So I'm going to just start fry my chicken and after that then I'll put everything in. And I'm making, as you see there is no eggs here because I don't, I only eat eggs whenever I bake a cake. Otherwise I don't use eggs at all. <laughs> inside here you know the sesame oil I got the sesame oil of Amazon oh, you cannot make fried rice without sesame oil tell me you're doing yourself 
an injustice if you make fried rice with a sesame oil. This is still so hot, but uh, steam is still coming out of it. Delicious. It is so. This is better than restaurant. Okay, this is better than the one you get at a restaurant. I guarantee you. You make this, please. When you make this, let me know that you made it. And um, this is so much better. It is like so pretty in here. Hmm. Like so hot. <laughs> but. This way, when you make your own, you can go back for seconds and third, you know what I mean? Instead of just, you have to order this one and then you probably want something later on or so. And anyway, this is all that I have to say for today, guys. Remember to hit like and leave me a comment below and share my videos. And if you're new to my channel and you're not yet subscribed, please hit that red subscribe and hit that notification bell. So when I upload new videos, you get a notification. And follow me on social. All the links to my social media is in my description box. And remember, all the ingredients is also in my description box. So go to my description box, guys. I'd love to hear from you. And I cannot wait to see you on my next video.